New trailer! New trailer! New trailer! Woo! Same as first trailer so far. Okay, all right. Let's go. This game is so colorful. This game has such a Pokemon Snap vibe. New Pokemon Snap. It's literally so new Pokemon Snappy. New Pokemon! First new Pokemon besides the starters! Oh! It doesn't look like a Pokemon, but it looks so cute! They always don't look like Pokemon at the start. That's adorable. Man, this game feels like actual life size. Like the size of these buildings, it's even crazier than the uh the wild area. Like those massive buildings. Who are you? Who are you? Oh, those skies. White Chunk, we got first look at the UI. Is that really called Light Chunk? <laughs> Wow, so with the open world format, that's like... It's like those are checkpoints. Those are like Pokemon centers. Was that the trade animation just in the overworld? Oh my god. Oh my god, true character customization. That looks like gyms. Looks like we got gyms back. All right, what's the catch? Box legendary? This feels like box legendary vibe. That has a lot to break down. Look at this high quality, not gameplay footage. What? Hello? Oh my God, they're aliens, what? The right one! I want the right one! The violet! Sierra, I'm violet! That's it, baby! The legends! Violet, Team Violet. Team Violet. Oh my god. Release date? November 18th! Oh my god. Typical. <laughs> Dude! Dude! Okay, first look, I think I prefer that. Them over Zash and Zamadenta. I definitely do, actually. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, all right, we need to watch this back. We need to watch this back at that classic. At that classic 0.5 times speed. Um. Okay, I will spare you guys the, uh, the, the, the volume of that, you know, at that speed. Hold on. Let's look. All right, so this opening, this is this is like normal. Like we already know about this, dude. The, the high tech lizards. Pre-orders are up. Hell yeah. So yeah, I guess like these are our Pokemon centers. It's so. It seems like just so freeform, kind of like Legends, just with the traditional Pokemon format. Which, you know, if you know my feelings about Legends, I love Legends, but the format just isn't for me. You know what's interesting? I feel like. Uh, Something about like, I feel like a lot of things are like missing like shading around like there's some word for it. I don't know exactly what it is. There's some technical term. Jesus, dude. Jesus. Let's go back like three frames. Wow. That is massive. That is massive. Cell shading, maybe. Yo, what's up, Cass? Okay, same, same, same. Got the TV. Texture, texture. You know what? You're right. This is such a Pokemon snap vibe. It is crazy how snappy it feels. You know what's funny? This feels like a fancier text box, just like Ultra Sun and Moon was compared to X and Y. Like Sword and Shield had like a basic bitch text box. I don't know. It's just funny. Like the little things that you realize. 
That's very pretty. Got our starters. The colors in this game are insane. This is after YouTube compression. Th these colors are insane. Look at the spring of Tito. Oh my god. Um, and I know, by the way, frame rate's a little rough, but I'm also playing at literally half speed, so keep in mind that. Um, oh my god, it's so bouncy. <laughs> right? Right, Chief? Who are you? Hmm. No voice acting, probably. Huh. Are you these two trainers? You know, are you these three? Do you get all three starters? Oh my god. Uh, no way. Their names are Koridon and Myro Myrodon. What the hell? That's very interesting. This feels... Okay. This literally feels just like a... The Legends Arceus vibe of, like, your battles are just in the overworld. Like, like you're just... You're out there, and you're battling. My ride on. Interesting. Yeah, this is literally, like... This is out there. This is out in the overworld. This little guy. Palmy? I like Palmy. Dude, Pokemon, say what you will, but they are so good with Pokemon designs. Like, wow. Oh, it's an electric type. Okay, cool, cool, cool. If you connect with friends, you can head out on adventures together up to four of you at a time. Interesting. Very interesting. What does that mean? Oh. You like go on like open world adventures? Dude, co op speedrun, but like actually? Oh, that's. Dude, the environments. The environments. That's something that Sword and Shield hella lacked. Like, they had different environments, but they were so like closed off and one dimensional. Th this little guy. <laughs> Th this little guy looks very interesting. <laughs> I mean, like... Eh. Small live grass normal setters. Thank you for the intel. I'm excited to see this UI in a minute. I'm very excited to see the UI. Dude, this little grump. This is like Pulse when he wakes up. <laughs> okay, UI, UI. Wow, this is so much similar to, wow, to Legends. Like, you have that 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 continuously rotating camera. And, like, the HP bar scaling to the Pokemon. Maybe not scaling, but conforming to where the Pokemon is. Any speed tech information? Lechonk is normal? Okay. Wait, is that Lechonk? Okay, this looks like Sword and Shield, uh, just looking at speedrun stuff. They exclamation point you. Oh my god, for the speedrun... Dude, like, all the trainers are gonna be optional. <laughs> How are we gonna beat this game fast? For the speedrun? Oh my god. I mean, there's... The trainers are all gonna be optional, what the hell? Yes, this game, it has to be more traditional. Like, it just, it, it is going to be. Like, there's no way it's not. I need to find my um my thumbnail screenshot. I guess that'll be the um the legendaries. <sighs> Love an ice area, dude. Ice areas are just always my favorite. Dude, look, literally the trade the trade sequence is in the overworld. 
that is a huge transition for Pokemon through Legends Arceus. I mean, they didn't do this even. But there's so much more in the overworld. Venonat! Yo, Julie, where you at? Yo, the tree's true. <laughs> there's so much more just in the overworld. Like the trades, the battles, they're all like there happening. You know? I feel like I missed this. This looks like a much, much, much more appealing cave than the Legends one. I will say that. Man, you know, it's so interesting. It's such a Pokemon thing. They got... They got the colors on this game incredible. They got the actual environments incredible. But the actual graphical fidelity and frame rate... Like I said, mind you, I'm playing at 0.5 speed. But the actual graphical fidelity and frame rate is like... Like, oof. Like, the textures and stuff are not looking great. But the actual, like, environments? The actual region design? Is... And, and the colors of everything are, are incredible. Which, which does help, obviously. Let me play at not 0.5 speed for a second. You know, that's not that bad. I am getting fooled by my own 0.5 times. That's what they prioritize. The switch is limited. Yeah, the switch doesn't let you do much. All right, I'm being a little harsh because of the 0.5 speed. Even if I was preemptively saying that myself. Oh, this looks awesome. Look at the sheen on Crag and all. That is just beautiful. This, 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 this looks genuinely gorgeous. I mean, hey, they got that pink sky. That's always a winner with Pokemon. Got the Talon Flame, and yeah, these these got to be gyms, or some kind of something just like a gym at least. It's fine. They were still going for that, like, Breath of the Wild vibe here with this camera. <laughs> and it's into just a bunch of water. <laughs> but actually, that's a pretty cool transition because it goes into this bit with the... With the Legends. All right, let me watch again and see if I'm actually Team Violet. What's the name of the purple one? Oh, dude, I also just love purple. I know it's like basic bitch of me, but like, I mean, come on. Yeah! What typing? Do we have typing? Pulling up Cerebi. <clears throat> My ride on. Do we have a typing? Myro, Myra, Myraudon, Myraudon, Myraudon. See, electric is my guess. That's a good guess. Um, Myraudon. Bro, bro. The other one's really cool. Myraudon. Yeah, that. Dude, the jet engines. That's insane. These are much better than the Sword and Shield Legends. These probably go toe-to-toe -to -toe with, like, Lunala Soul Gloria, which I like. Honestly, they, they're probably higher than them, now that I say that out loud. The Scarlet one... <laughs> this one's funny. Um, and we have a release date. November 18th. I mean, nothing... No surprise, like I said. Typical. Um, has digital eyes. Yeah, I... Chat! Let's compare the YouTube comment section versus Twitch chat, okay? Chat, say Scarlet for the Scarlet Legend, Violet for the Violet Legend. YouTube comment section, you type Scarlet or Violet. I'm, I'm gonna tally them up. Oh my god, they are digital! Oh my god! Oh my god! Violet, Violet, don't let me sway you, you know? Or maybe it's just great. Violet, Violet, Scarlet, Violet, 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 Lechonk. <laughs> Scarlet, Violet, Scarlet, Violet, Violet, Scarlet, both, both boring. 
I mean, they're both really good. I will, I will say. I actually genuinely really like both of them. I did not like Zashi and Zamazenta. I did not. I, I just was not uh, a fan. Well, very nice. YouTube, thanks for watching. Go and subscribe. And if you're watching literally right now, literally when this video drops, anytime during this day, uh, I'm beating every 3DS speedrun in one sitting on Twitch. Twitch.tv slash the fourth gen gamer. Like, I'm live for 20 hours today. So if you want to watch that, check it out. All right, goodbye. Thanks for watching.